It all started three years ago at my local Toys R Us when I purchased my first yo-yo, a Dunkin' Dragonfly. I picked up and dropped many different hobbies, but yo-yoing was different. Throughout my entire yo-yoing journey, I feel like there was something that always pushed me to continue. The reason I yo-yo is because it makes me smile. I feel like yo-yoing has become more than just a pastime for me now. It's become something more than just a way to spend an hour on the weekends. I find myself spending more hours making my new trick routine checking up on the yo-yo expert forums, and I honestly wouldn't want it any other way. I sometimes yo-yo in front of others, and it's the best feeling in the world to see their face light up with happiness as you do the simplest of tricks. It truly makes my day. I still remember the first time when I taught my science teacher how to walk the dog. His face after he landed that trick was the happiest I've ever seen him. Yo-yoing has played such a large part of my life, I honestly could not imagine myself without it. Yo-yoing is sort of like life in a way. Every yo-yo will run out of spin eventually, but it's not how long the yo-yo spins, but what tricks we do while the yo-yo is spinning that's important. I feel so lucky yo-yoing is part of my life, because when I eventually run out of spin, I can say that I had a hobby that made me smile. My name's Aaron Zhao, I'm 15 years old, and that is why I throw.